Bolton Wanderers are a League One club based in Bolton in Lancashire and play at the University of Bolton Stadium, which has a capacity of 28,723. Bolton's badge simply shows the initials of the club, BWFC, in a ball shape with a Lancashire rose and a ribbon and the founding date underneath. Bolton were formed as Christchurch FC in 1874 by a reverend and a schoolmaster. However, three years later they had an argument and so the team split into two, one of which became Bolton Wanderers in 1877. The term Wanderers was used for teams who didn't have one particular home ground and so would wander around playing in different locations. Bolton would become founding members of the Football League in 1888 and reach their first FA Cup final in 1894, but lost out to Notts County 4-1. They'd move to their home of 102 years the following year, Burnden Park, and they then reached their second final a decade later, but lost again, this time to Manchester City. Bolton would become one of the top teams in England just before and after the First World War, often finishing in the top eight and as high as third up until the late 1920s. During this time, Bolton won three FA Cups. The first was a 2-0 win over West Ham in 1923, where there was a reported crowd of 126,000, though it was possibly much more. As the crowd was so large, it created huge difficulties, and a disaster was narrowly avoided by spectators having to run onto the pitch. It also caused Bolton players to have to walk the last half mile to the stadium and the match began 45 minutes late. The second was revenge over Man City, this time Bolton were victorious 1-0 in 1926 and then in 1929 they defeated Portsmouth 2-0. Bolton would dip in form and get relegated in 1933 but they'd quickly bounce back and have a prolonged period in the top flight lasting until the mid 60s. During World War II many of the Bolton players and staff joined the military and saw action and this was actually quite rare for top sportsmen who normally were given other service roles. But led by their captain Harry Goslin, many of the first team joined the fight and sometimes participated in football matches along the way. Goslin was the sole fatality in World War II from the Bolton Wanderers squad. Just after World War II, a club legend would join Bolton, Nat Lofthouse, who scored 255 league goals for them between 1946 and 1960, helping them to many good finishes in the top flight during this time. They'd also go to the FA Cup final in 1953, losing to Blackpool 4-3 in the Matthews final. But five years later, Bolton would return and win this time against Manchester United in the final thanks to two Nat Lofthouse goals. After Lofthouse left, Bolton soon began a decline. They'd be relegated to the second division in 1964 and relegated to the third division for the first time ever in 1971. They would rise again though, managing quick promotions which saw them back in the top flight by 1978. But they'd fall just as quick, securing two relegations in four years, leaving them back in the third division. It got even worse as in 1987 the club would be relegated to the fourth tier for their first time ever. After a few years of building the club back up they managed to win promotion to the top flight again in 1995 after a 4-3 win over Reading in the playoff final. From there Bolton would become a yo-yo club, bouncing up from the championship and down from the Premier League quite quickly. But after promotion in 2001 they just about managed to survive in the Premier League for the next couple seasons and once they gained that foothold they were able to build on it with manager Sam Allardyce. He managed to take them to the UEFA Cup places in 2005 and managed top 8 finishes consecutively from 2004 to 2007. But Allardyce would leave claiming the board weren't ambitious enough and from there Bolton would scrap to survive again but managed to do so. But then in 2012 Fabrice Mwemba would collapse on the pitch after a cardiac arrest and that season Bolton were relegated from the top flight. Things went from bad to worse for Bolton as after they couldn't manage to win back promotion to the Premier League the club was in financial trouble for not paying taxes and being in large debt. This culminated in a transfer embargo and Bolton's relegation to the third tier in 2016. After a few years of scraping by financially, the club faced major financial troubles in 2019, culminating in players refusing to play due to unpaid wages, resulting in the club forfeiting a match. That year they officially entered administration and were days away from being liquidated, but they were able to just about find new owners and the club was saved. They would go down to the fourth tier though, but then be promoted in 2020 to take them back to League One, where they are today. Bolton's greatest achievement would be any of their four FA Cup wins, Bolton playing a white shirt with a navy and red trim. This is traditionally paired with navy shorts and white socks. Their nicknames are Wanderers, the Whites, and most commonly the Trotters. Trotters has multiple potential sources. One is that it's simply another word for Wanderers, another claims it was a local word for practical jokers, or it could be that at one of their initial grounds they'd sometimes have to retrieve the ball and trot through a pig pen. Bolton's main rivals were Bury, but due to the expulsion from the Football League in 2019, maybe not so much anymore. They also have a strong rivalry with Wigan, as well as other Lancashire clubs like Blackburn, Preston and Oldham. One interesting fact about Bolton is that they have spent the most seasons in the top flight, 76, without winning the league title. And that was the quick history of Bolton Wanderers. Up next is Bradford City.